James DeGale vs. Caleb Truax rematch. KO or no? Last time out in December, James DeGale lost a points decision to Caleb Truax. And in the process, he was relieved of his IBF super middleweight title. He has now got the opportunity to regain his title and prove that it was just a one-off. And he had a bad evening. Caleb Truax was not really well known and was a fighter that if you were to beat then you would be progressing to the next stage of your career. Or so we thought. He is not the stepping stone fighter he was branded and he showed a great deal of skill and heart in dispatching the arguably the best super middleweight in the division. He smothered DeGale and didn't tire throughout the fight. He was right there applying pressure to DeGale who struggled to find a response. Truax had an emphatic fifth round, almost having DeGale out on his feet. DeGale bravely recovered, though, but Truax did not allow him to come back. DeGale struggled the remainder of the fight to have any real success and was defeated on the decision. Now we have the rematch. DeGale has been there with Truax now, and knows that he cannot allow for any mistakes as he will be trumped again so he must use his jab and skillful combinations to thwart the smaller man. Truax will be coming forward all night. His plan will be to smother DeGale. As he is a smaller man, he is going to have to get inside and work. Truax has got good hand speed, meaning he can get in some good shots off, then slip back out. This is where he runs the risk of getting hit with something he doesn't see coming. James DeGale does hit very hard, and he will be countering Truax. Degel will use his reach to his advantage, keeping Truax at range where he can box him. He won't want to be taking any silly shots, and will be elusive using good footwork and movement. I believe this has the potential to be a great fight. Truax will keep coming all night. He won't want to give up the world title he won in such great fashion. And James Degel will have the bit between his teeth to regain his lost world title. This fight could easily end within the distance considering the relentlessness of Truax and remembering that fifth round in the last fight. And on the flip side, DeGale has very heavy hands and has the ability to take anyone out in the super middleweight division. All that's left now is to settle in and get ready for the fight. Are you ready guys? Let's get ready to rumble!